on the top I talked about the melody too it's a so matching every single chord with those notes so so it, it sounds crazy but really all I'm doing is in between playing minor thirds all the way down and the melody on the top So it just takes a little bit of a, a little bit of coordination. Come on, you guys can do it as well. Piano players do it all the time. So why can't we, right? So if you want to think about it in a more general sense of the chord, like a three-note chord. So we have uh, first inversion, uh, B major chord, D minor six chord, uh, D flat minor seven chord. <laughs> it's tough going down and saying all of these at the same time. D minor, D flat minor seven chord, C minor six chord. There it is. Same exact chord back to back. Da, da, B minor six chord. All right. So da, 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 da. it's really, it's really simple. It sounds crazy, right? Da, 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 da. Going back to a minor seven chord, B flat minor seven chord. All right. Then back to that minor six chord. And I end a lot of my cadences like that when I'm in a, a major key. Like a, almost like a two five one is like an inversion, not inversion, but like you know alternate type of chord progression instead of I can do same thing. So first inversion, I'm ending on the first inversion of my main chord, right of E, all while holding out the E. All the way down. 